Hello. So this is my first weekly vlog in a while, I guess in two weeks, but here we are. I just got home yesterday from Costa Rica and it was an amazing trip. I had so much fun. It was a very relaxing trip. Like normally when we go on trips, when I go on trips with anybody, um, whether it's my friends or Chris or whoever, it's always very like go, go, go. Like we have so much stuff planned, which is fine. I love doing that because I love getting to do as much stuff as possible. But this time we really took a few days to just relax and just take everything in. And I also didn't post a lot online for this trip. Like I really took some time off partially because we didn't have Wi-Fi everywhere but also I just wasn't really thinking about it I wasn't like tweeting a lot or like posting a lot of photos just because I don't know it was nice to just like take back and like not really do that this time so it was just really amazing we had a great time we didn't film quite as much as I normally do like I said I was just kind of like taking it all in but I do have a lot of stuff to post I'm not sure if I'm gonna do it like a day by day this time I don't think I will because I didn't take that much footage but we'll see I'm gonna definitely put something up with it so I have that coming up obviously my Europe videos have been coming out since I left I set them all up to go up while I was on vacation so those should all be done I think by the time I'm filming this the last one is finished so yay um so Europe is finally finished so Costa Rica will be coming soon but I just wanted to start off my weekly vlog this week by showing you my new little setup so while I was gone Chris not only rearranged the entire apartment and put everything in a new spot but he also set up my birthday present which was a vanity that he got for me and I'm so excited I love it so much so it's really messy right now because I'm doing my makeup because I just decided to do this while I'm filming but here is what we're looking at here it is I have my lights there I have a spot to sit everything is just so cute I have these drawers i'm not sure how i'm gonna set up everything and organize it because my makeup is in a separate organizer i'll probably try to put that like on one of the sides or something but it's just so cute and beautiful and the rest of the house is organized as well chris just moved all the furniture around and it looks so good and i'm obsessed with it oh the lighting is so good i love having good lighting to my makeup so yeah i'm very happy with my new setup and i'm still organizing it but we'll see how that turns out so i guess i don't have like all that much to talk about just since the bulk of my activity the last couple weeks has obviously been being on vacation so like you know you'll see that eventually i'm gonna try to edit them faster than i edited the europe ones because i'm getting into this habit where i post my past vacation videos while i'm on my current vacation and it's just really like weird so we'll see my next big trip is going to be alaska which isn't until like august september but we do have a couple small things like we have some weddings to go to and stuff coming up so i have to get ready for those but my next big one isn't until alaska so hopefully i will have time to edit everything before then but our trip was great we went to so many cool places and did so many fun things we saw a volcano we went to some hot springs we saw sloths oh my god the sloths were so cute I am so excited to show you the video of that. They were so adorable and cute. We went to this like rescue ranch where it's like a rehabilitation center for rescued Costa Rican animals and their goal is to completely get 100% re-released into the wild. A lot of sloths get turned into them as orphans because their moms died either like they were hit by a car or they thought that a power line was a branch. Unfortunately, the mom will die but the baby will be rescued by this place they will teach it how to be a sloth basically and then they'll try to re-release it this location did not allow us to hold or touch the sloths which a lot of people were like why didn't you go hold a sloth well the answer is because these sloths get really stressed out and anxious when they're held by someone who they don't know so a lot of times when you go to those places where they're like oh hold a sloth for 25 dollars they it actually is really bad for them and that is what the keepers there told us so we totally respect that they also did not allow us to take any photos with the animals because they wanted to maintain the fact that this is a rescue center it's not a tourist attraction it's not meant to like turn them into circus animals you know like this is for their health and their benefit so they didn't want anybody to get the wrong idea about the center that we went to the program we did was called slothies and coffees which is basically like a tour of the plantation they give you um like some snacks and beverages obviously coffee they spent extra time on the sloths but you get a tour of the entire ranch so we got to see all the animals that they have there a couple of the animals they have are permanent because they were either like kept as pets or they otherwise just don't have the survival skills to be in the wild so they can't be released so they do have a couple of animals that will always live there but they are really well taken care of and stuff and that place we went to was called the toucan rescue ranch and it's a great stuff they're doing incredible things there so we were very happy to support them and spend some of our dollars there my other favorite thing that we did was we went zip lining me and sarah did it was so much fun and i don't know if we're gonna get any photos or videos from that because we did get our photo taken but we didn't get a chance to go look at them slash buy any but it was so much fun. It was amazing. I never felt like unsafe or anything. It was just a blast. Like they literally just hook you in, sit down and you go flying. It's 
incredible. I loved it so much. Oh my god, my coworker just texted asking if I want Starbucks. Wow, I love going to work. Anyway, something else I really loved doing was we went to the volcano and we did some hot springs nearby. We stayed in like the nicest hotel ever. It was gorgeous. It was stunning and they had the nicest hot springs. It was so much fun. We took a lot of GoPro footage there because Anna's cousin had a GoPro that she let us borrow, but I do not have that footage yet. Like I will have it by the time we do the vlog, but I don't have anything to show you yet, but hopefully it all turned out. Hopefully it's not just like black and you can hear us screaming or anything. But yeah, the trip was incredible. We had a great time. Unfortunately, obviously coming home from vacation always sucks. So I have some stuff I have to take care of. I have some homework to do. I did all the homework that was due while we were there, but I have some stuff that's due like this coming weekend. So I got to do that tonight or tomorrow. And then of course, like unpacking always really sucks but i'm unpacked like I, I finished unpacking i have to just finish my laundry so that's a new record for me it's always nice to come home to like you know your bed and your shower oh my god coming home to the shower that you're familiar with is like the best nothing against any of the showers that we had on vacation but like it's your shampoo you know like there's nothing to figure out there's no weird knobs to turn or anything so i don't know it's just nice to come home to your shower so yeah i'm home from vacation it sucks but it was amazing we had so much fun and obviously i came home to chris and teddy so that was a added bonus as well our whole house looks beautiful and chris cleaned the entire place i love being married to a virgo this is incredible that's all for right now um, i'm gonna go to work unfortunately i was not intelligent enough to take off the day after i get back again i keep doing this but maybe I'll learn eventually someday to take off the day after I get back from vacation. But that's all for right now. And I'm going to go ahead to work. And I will see you later. Okay, hello. How are you doing? So I intended to film more this week. I really did. I just didn't. It's been, I would say it's been crazy. But it really hasn't even. It's just been like... All I've been doing is working and doing my homework to catch up on what I missed and I haven't really done anything even remotely if a little bit exciting. Nothing really was important enough to film. So here we are. It's Tuesday right now and if it looks like I just woke up it's because I did. So this morning I had another cool backstage tour opportunity that I got to do with my team. We went to Haunted Mansion today so it was really really amazing. It's one of my favorite tours. This was the second time I've gotten to do Haunted Mansion so that was really cool. We got to see all this really awesome behind the scenes stuff and learned a lot about the ride so it was amazing. I love going to to do this kind of stuff with my team it's always so much fun so that was really amazing but it was also very early i had to be there at 6 a.m so i was very tired and i don't work tonight until super late so i came home and took a lovely nap it is about two o'clock now now i'm just gonna go get ready for work it is my friday so finally i can go to the grocery store and buy some food chris bought me a few things while i was gone on vacation but mostly i've just been getting by i've been buying my food at lunch every day for work and that is just like I, it's terrible i feel so bad doing it because i'm wasting so much money but I literally have nothing to eat at home. So I've just been trying to um, be creative with what I am eating at home. So I haven't even had interesting dinners to make because I've been working really late every day so I don't have time to come home and make dinner. So there hasn't even been a Crayla in the kitchen to show you. It's all it's all changing tomorrow. Everything's back to normal starting tomorrow. So tomorrow is our day off and we will be doing some fun things like taking Teddy to the vet. Not the vet, the groomer. He just went to the vet. He needs to go to the groomer so bad. Look at this little fluff ball. Oh my goodness. You need to groom so bad. And also we're obviously going to go to Target and get some groceries because I have nothing. So I'll finally be able to cook and have food again. As of today, all the Europe videos are officially up. So I'm very glad to be done with that. Sad to see it end and sad to not have any more to watch and edit. But um, I'm glad to be finished editing them. So they're all up now and you can go and watch those if you are interested. And I've been getting some really nice nice feedback on those so thank you if you already watched them i finished all my homework while i was gone i only had a few things luckily my classes this semester are not that hard i only have a few assignments a week so it wasn't that much to catch up on while i was gone i think this weekend i don't know what else we are doing i have a therapy appointment and man i didn't realize how much i missed my therapist i have so much to tell her it's been like two weeks that's honestly honestly it so Sorry that this was such a boring video of just me talking and little shots of Teddy hanging out, but that is just how it is sometimes. Oh my god, look at what a little dweeb. What are you doing? But that's all. That's literally it. I'm gonna get ready for work now. Next week we'll be back more into the swing of things and have more going on than just me talking at you. That's all. And I will see you next time. Goodbye.